What up YouTube? It's me, it's me, it's your favourite today. Just finish work. Standard. Um I'm gonna get to my Spock Hall in a bit. But I wanted to go through with you um something that I've been thinking about. Um there's been this thing that's going around that people are liking my wise videos more than mine. That does not me. That's all. So, I was thinking of this thing to get Shalma on the vlogs because she's. It's hard work to get her on the vlogs, to be fair. She doesn't particularly like getting on the vlogs. Um, I was thinking about doing a new feature. Ooh. I was thinking about doing a new feature. Um. If you ever watched Ant vs. Deck and stuff like that, I'm thinking about doing Steve vs. Shell. All for the feminists out there, Shell vs. Steve. Thinking about doing it. I asked Shell about it yesterday, she said she's up for it. But we're going to think, so I want your input. We're going to think of some stuff. I don't know when I'm going to start doing it, maybe once a week, maybe once a fortnight, I'm not sure. But we're thinking about doing Steve vs. Shell. I'll win, obviously. Maybe, I don't know, Steve vs. Shell over every three months or something. And then one of us has to do a forfeit. Something along them lines. It's in its infancy at the minute. But yeah. Yeah, I was thinking about filming up the vlogs. Um, also, Friday, I normally do a live vlog. Um, I normally have a few people come and chat. Uh, this Friday, I don't think I'm going to be doing one. Unless I do one live from my new loft. Which, no, I suppose that could be an idea. Um, because um, I'm getting the loft done, so... I'll have something to show on Friday, that's the only reason. I hate that. The moustache are going like... Don't do it when I try it. The hair gets down here. I've lost my shaver. I don't know where it is. Probably one of the kids has took it. Um, but yeah. So that's something that's going around and made it. I mean, it's Steve versus Shell. Look, obviously it's got to be fair, it's not going to be like, I don't know, a wrestling contest, because I'm going to win that, or a strength contest, because I'm going to win that, obviously. I'm a man. Let the hate get down in the comments. Um, yeah, maybe it can be fair ones for sure, where we do baking. Or, oh, I don't know. Rose picking. Who can pick the most roses? It's a girl thing. But anyway, um, if you can put your ideas down below and we'll have a. Th what's the word? A sif? Is it a sif? We'll have a sif through them and then we'll think about it. I don't know if it's starting next week or maybe the week after. We'll have a look. But for now, this is Mosh Bock Hall. What up, YouTube? Uh, this is the spock hole I've been talking about. Um, yeah, we've got all this from a lady on Spock the weekend. I was having a look through Spock, looking up some WWE stuff, and I noticed she was like selling um, WWE figures for like a pound each. There are some duds in here. Um, I haven't gone through them yet, but there's like mini ones and stuff like that. So. But ones that aren't even... I don't even know what that is. Actually, I think that's Disco Inferno. Who is it? It looks like Disco Inferno. Anyway, um, I'm getting distracted. Yeah, there's some wrestlers there that I've never seen before. 
so I need to go through them. But I think there's like 30 to 40 figures there. Obviously, some of them are going to be these little duddy ones that the parents have picked them up and they've wanted wrestling figures and they've got them cheap ones. But yeah, um, there's about 30 to 40 there. I normally I'll go through them, see if there's any standing out that cost a bit more, and then I'll put them into two. So you put them into two for about six, seven, eight quid each. Depending if there's an outlying one that costs about six quid or. I was I was cut it off. If a wrestler costs about six quid, I'll put it as its own listing. If they're um, if they're under six, I'll put them together. And anyway, I um, she also had a couple of rings, and then she also had this Scooby Doo stuff with the two mystery machines. Sorry about that. the washing. Two mystery machines, and then I only saw that one, and then she threw that one in as well. So I said, "Do how much do you want for them all?" She was selling these for a pound each. I think she was selling the ring. She was selling the ring and two figures for a fiver. Yeah, there was two rings, two figures for a fiver. So I said, "How much do you want for?" All? And she was like. Oh, how much do you want to pay? And I thought, well, I don't know, so I thought about 20 quid. And she said, yep, that's fine. And so for all this, and all these figures, yeah, I got it for 20 quid. So, um, the rings I've sold before, I'm going to look into that one. I have already got that ring listed, but it normally has like a big, how can I put it? Contraption on the top of it. And what you have to do, is see where. So it's basically you're meant to have a wrestler either side and then you press on them and it flips the wrestlers um, either side but there is more to it and I've got that listed at the minute for 30 quid with a couple of wrestlers with it but there's got a few watches but no one's budging but it's been on there for a while I'm thinking maybe Christmas it'll shift um, there's another wrestling ring um, I haven't searched it but it's got the cell on the side um, so I'm guessing that's part of the Hell in a Cell contraption, but obviously the cage isn't with it. But at the least, I'll be able to get a tenner each on the rings. Um, these Scooby-Doo houses, I've looked them up. You can, It's really confusing, because these mystery machines I've sold for a tenner with a few figures before. And I think I've sold one on, on its own for a tenner. I can't remember. But these buildings have sold on eBay with the figures and the mystery machines for 15 quid. And the fact that I've got a tenner for just one of them. I'm not going, well, okay, I could put these two mystery sh machines together with those two buildings and get 15 quid and get 30 quid. Or I could try and list them two with some figures together. Um... With some figures with them for a tenner each and shoot for maybe 12 for each of them and just leave them on there, they'll go by Christmas. But yeah, that was my um, Spock haul. Thank you very much for watching. As I said earlier about the Steve vs. Shell, let me know what you think and any challenges that you think me and Shell should do against each other. But for now, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to get some listing done. Bye bye. Peace out. Stay safe. Stay beautiful.